What's on YouTube? Running some errands. Gotta run some errands. Gotta be running some errands. I think I should record. I think I'm going to record in the gym. Just bought this shit. Yeah, look at all that kind of games. Whew. Let's turn on the fucking car. Man. Let's turn. Let's turn. Hope everybody having a great Saturday. Get my seatbelt on. Safety, safety's first. Because we're gonna hit the gym. Hope everybody having, like I said, having a great Saturday. A few hours ago, I was trying to get myself prepared and get some cardio and hoop uh, with me and my friend Miles. Because right now we got an upcoming game. So stay tuned, like literally, we got an upcoming game. I'm not, I would say I'm not in the best shape, but I, but I can say I'm all right. You know, your boy trying to get, get back in style so he can, not in style, but just keep on working and pushing himself to be better at this type of age. What the fuck is they doing? <laughs> All right, my excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, because people around here. Oh, damn, man. I might as well go the other day. I should've went that way. Fuck, bro. Man, fuck it. I'll go this way. And turn around. But yeah, like I said, leave a like, subscribe, and do not forget to press the notification button so you would never miss a single banger. That's why all I pull bangers around here, man. It's not that difficult, it's not that hard. I'm taking a long way. So right now, I'm about to go work out. Hopefully I can record in this gym. I'm gonna try to do a little bit of recording. Um, but yeah, this is the new, this is a, this is brand new and this is improving. Since I haven't been uploading videos, like gaming videos, I've been trying to, especially on 2K23. I've been trying to because I have a little issue with OBS Studio on the black, the black screen. I had a problem with that, so got a problem with the black screen. Yeah, and as soon as I fix the black screen, I can't hear no audio on the um, OBS. So it's getting a little difficult, so I stopped messing with it because I'm looking on fucking YouTube and shit and trying to figure out what to fucking do and how to take this off so I can give you guys great content every nightly basis. But it seems like that shit ain't working, so right now I'm trying to focus on how to upload videos of me playing basketball. Now, to be honest, I am mean, not the third guy that's been, I'm not the third best, well, I probably am the third best guy. We, I'm not a number one. I'm damn sure not number two. I'm probably going to be three. That's best of the team, so. Dang, they got that U-Haul on. Um, they got that shit open. Hey, somebody beat that horn for some fly out. <laughs> Let me move the other fucking way. Oh, excuse my language. But yeah, they, I bet they speeding. They speeding up. They trying to get to. They trying to get their attention. Get their attention, people. Get their attention. Yeah, they speeding up. Damn, that's tough. 
tough. But yeah, um, I'm I'm kind of excited. Um, I I kind of not kind of, but I am excited to play. Um, been training a little bit with my friend Miles because he he got a business running. He teach people how to play basketball. It can be a beginner. It can be an upcomer. He 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 wants to build other people and build himself up of the game of basketball. I like that. I like the style of play. He's a, I, I'll say he, he's the best dribble basically on the team. Um, I can give I give this man a lot of credit because this man is he's that he's that person you know he's that type of person he's that dude you know um, but right now I know I'm not that guy. Try not to be overwhelmed or something like that. Because to, even today we were playing a lot of games and I was missing a lot of shots. We was all I was playing bad. I can say I'm playing bad because I need to, I know what I need to work on. Right now I'm figuring out what I need to work on. I've been working out these couple of days sometimes, getting into the gym and working my shot and try to um, practice on my shot. Even I practice on my left hand layups and I practice on shooting with my left hand. It's all about trying to figure out what's the mistake. And this is what I really needed. Instead of me playing and practicing, I, it's good practicing by yourself, but I really want to have that experience on playing 5v5 so I can get used to it. Because if I can get used to it, I'm gonna be, on, be more deadly on what I need to do in games and type situations. So it's just me, it's just learning. I'm just trying to learn. You know, I never been through the situation. I played, I, I actually did play through high school. Not played through high school, I did practice with high school. I think in my 11th grade year, practice. My mind, in my mind, is always telling me not to fail. I haven't failed in those practice, like drills and stuff like that. I showed what I am capable of. And I can remember it on top of my head. People probably won't believe me and stuff like that. I really don't give a damn. The only thing I didn't do is shoot. All I was worrying about is defense and I was being effective at the defensive end. What the fuck is y'all doing? What the fuck is you doing? What the hell y'all stopping for? Get your ass up the damn way! Damn, holding up damn traffic right here. Shit. These niggas holding up traffic. Ain't that something? But yeah, like I was saying. Get your slow ass out the damn way. Jeez. Now what I was saying again, I probably forgot what the hell I was saying. I forgot what the hell I was saying. Oh yeah, high school. I was, all I was worrying about is defending. I was bad at shooting, but I was great. I had athleticism. I'll say I had athleticism back then, but now I can't jump how I used to. Ah. I barely can shoot. Some stuff that I'm just trying to work on. Fuck, bro. They need to move that shit out the way. But it's some stuff that I'm trying to work on, man. You know, I don't want to let the let all I worry about is letting the team down. I don't want to let the team down over me. Not not playing right type of basketball even though I want to play a right type of basketball. One thing I won't be looking like is fucking Westbrook. I won't look like that nigga, man. I won't be looking like him this season. Hell no. I highly doubt that. But I think coming forward this season, to be honest, the reason why I'm doing this is because I'm trying to get back how I was back then and even though even way it goes I can't get back where I was back then you know 
because at that time I used to like I, I love getting content but now I, I don't love getting content because I got so much content and I got hurt from that shit so much it's crazy But I'm trying to get that, like, like I used to like that content coming to the chef, stuff like that. But now, dang it, that's, that, that's that nigga, man. That's, oh, Lord. I see them. I, oh, damn, bro. I see my um friend, cousins. They, they walk by. Game rolled down the window, but. I seen him just in time, bro. So far right here. I should not. All I'm about to do is give me a sleeve. I want to sleeve so bad, bro. <laughs> but yeah, that's why uh, I'm not used to having contests like that, man. I'm just afraid to get myself injured, but this season, I'm going to put my body on the line. You know, if you, if you really want to get the dub, um, I got to have that mentality that I can, um, that I can body niggas. Have a little problem with my foot. Hopefully, it's not that bad. Every time I wear, every time I wear them Kyrie's, I, I got my foot. Feel bad, but when I wear these little runs, I feel good. So I'm about to go to Hibbit Sports. Let me show you. Got the Hibbit Hibbit Sports. I'm about to go in there and we about yeah we about to go in there and try to. I might as well take you guys with me. I can't leave you guys in the car. I gotta take you with me, so let's go and see what they got. Go watch this. See this? Um, I didn't know how much this costs. Jordan sleeve. Should I get large? $22. Should I get this? I'm not gonna go get my homeboy. Damn, man. A nigga trying to work out and you call him. Change the plans. We're gonna try to probably go out and go check my homeboy. Hibbits. 
We out here. Just got my shit. We're gonna try it on the car. Right. When I buy shit, I like try them on right then and there. We about to go on the trip, ladies. All right, we're gonna have to go get that nigga, man. I like Nike. I'm sorry for Jordan. I seen Jordan. It would have looked good with the white tee, but fuck it, bro. I got to get the black Nike. I want to get medium. I don't know. Oh, I got two of them. No wonder it's worth. It's worth it. It's worth it. It's worth it. What do you kid got from? Oh shit. Here we go. Oh shit. This, this shit kind of tight. What? The? Oh shit. Oh, no wonder they was running. It was them dogs. Dogs, man. Them dogs, something else. Damn, this shit tight. Damn, this shit's tight. Make it crumble up or something. Them dogs ain't gonna bother y'all. Bro. I think I bought the wrong one. Let me see. Damn, this shit can't. Yeah, bam. Bam. Bro. Shit. Put it up a little bit. Damn, this shit tight. I'm almost up to my damn arm. You <clears throat> bought me a white tee. Got a motherfucking sleeve. Gonna work out with this shit. Alright. Damn. I think I should have ball small. Ooh. <laughs> Alright, let me stop. Let's go. Thought I was gonna do some workout action. Now I gotta pick up a nigga action. Actually pick up a nigga. This year is gonna be a banger year, ladies and gentlemen. Those children of all ages. It's gonna be a brand new year for my YouTube channel. I'm going that's why I'm doing this for a reason. That's why I'm doing this for a reason. That's why I'm making content for you guys for a reason. Because I love you guys. I know I don't got a lot of big YouTubers. I'm not big yet. But, hey, we're always going to be bigger and we're going to be better. We always that. That's what that's what we always is. What the fuck? These dogs would come in my damn way. One is lipping. They all over the place because I'm afraid to move and hit these motherfuckers. Hit these motherfuckers or something. Like I said, um, I'm trying to figure out some stuff, you know. But basically, for YouTube and for you guys to enjoy, that's why this basketball 5v5 men's league 
I'm doing that because of you guys. Um, I thought that would be a great idea to do. If I play suck, I play suck. But right now, if but once that game starts, once that ball go up in the air, all I can think about is how hard can I go and so we can win. What can I do con so I can contribute? You know, it's not gonna be all about me shooting. It's not gonna be all about me um, messing up. I want to do different things. I want to. I see that. That's what's. That's what's a part of the basketball life. You know. But back to my homeboy Miles. This man been playing, playing since. I don't know, high school, maybe middle school. He's a hooper hooper. I call him a hooper hooper. You know, take that from cash book, but he's really that he's really that uh, guy that would seems like leave it all on the court, you know. So I gotta I gotta do the same thing, you know, leave it on the court. I at the time when I was young, I always used to say pain don't hurt me. People look at me and say why in the hell you would say pain don't hurt you if you can't hurt and I said I say that because I don't want pain I don't want pain to affect how I'm gonna play I don't want pain to affect how I play any type of sports or game because every time I got hurt I always get back up and play through that injury and no, nobody never knew that played street ball Got blooded, got cut, got hurt on my knees, messed up my, I, I kept on landed at Rome on both ankles a lot of times in the streets. So I, I kind of messed up my body and then as soon as I didn't play no sports, my body let go. It seems like I got to get myself out of that hole so I can be the best version of me, you know? And I think he sees that in me as well. Um, and I see it in him as well. Like, this man is, is that damn good. It's, it's, I can see. I really can. And if he watching this video, I know I'm giving his flowers. It's good to give somebody flowers. I always say I can beat him, even though it was 0% chance, but it's all about confidence. We play one game, and it just makes me feel better. It makes me feel better playing against them because I know I can get better. Even though I lose a lot of times, the one game that I like when I played against him is when I mess around and hurt him. It was not intentionally, but that was like the best defense that I can put and I was tired ran out of stamina but I think if I can play him now um, I probably would still lose but I'll probably still put up a good fight that's where you should have somebody by your side it doesn't matter if they can score it does matter but it's all about if they have heart to go through the war that you want to go through. If they can go through the same war that you can go through, if they can do the same, if they can tolerate the same push and beating that you can, then you can go to war with them. You know, I don't want no I, I don't want nobody on my team that doesn't want to try. I guess I get upset with that, especially in video games. If people do not try, that shit upset me. At least you try. As long as you try your best I'm not gonna get mad about that. If you miss a lot of shots and you putting in the work and you showing that I'm trying to be the best version that I can, and you putting that on the court, showing that you're trying to be the best you can, okay, I can't get mad about that. It doesn't matter if, if, if a L happens or whatever, you put your best on that floor. It's all about what you can do, what the mistakes that you have done and what you can do to contribute even more the next game. That's all I can see. This is my first season. I'm not trying to be a big swole head. I don't I don't like calling for the ball. I, 
I don't do none of that. I'm not like a ball hog. All I care about if I can get open and I, can I hit shots, can I can I um, do some defense. Like I really want to show people and even you guys, I want to put this on YouTube so I so people can say, dang, this this dude a little decent. He's all right. He's kind of good, but he's not a hooper level. I'm not gonna say I'm on a hooper level. I'm not going to say I'm on a hoopers level. I would never be delusional to the fact that I can be the better person in the team. I would never be the better person in the team because the better person in our team now, he have been grinding since day one. He, is, he still grinds till now. And I look at that work ethic that he does and say, damn, I got to put up a show for him to realize that I can be there when he I can, so he, I want him to count on me, and it's a big plate to carry, and then I'm going to upload this on YouTube as well, now I got to put up a show for you guys, I, now I got to put a show on for you guys, because I don't want to look slow on the court, but my man Miles, you already got a business running? Ready to grow. I really support what he does. This man is I can see it can it can grow over time. The business is gonna grow, you know. But the meantime, the meantime, I'm going to I don't know about this season. I'm still going to upload more videos. And it's probably going to be professional wrestling. I always said I was going to get into that. Um, but it's, it's, you got to start somewhere. I'm at the age of 21, so you got to do whatever it takes. That's what I'm going to do, is do whatever it takes. About, right now, I'm about to head to my homeboy's house. It's already 12 minutes of me talking. But, yeah. We'll see at my homeboy's house. I love you guys. I hope you guys subscribe and don't forget to leave a like. And <laughs> don't forget. Damn. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. I love you guys. I hope you support me on what I'm trying to do for the for the uh, YouTube community. J Ray, I really appreciate it you guys and some those who's watching this video now those who's pressing that like button right now put that banger because there are more content that i'm gonna bring this year my nigga this year yes this year there's a lot of shit coming there's a new episode coming and i'm going to go crazy at every opportunity I'll get. J-Ray is out. Bitch, go, bro. What the fuck is you taking your long... What the fuck is you taking your long ass time? See, though, these people right here can't drive for goddamn shit. You sat at this red light for fucking 10 damn seconds. 10 damn seconds. Maybe 20, 30 seconds. Your ass could have been pushing that fucking gas pedal. Fucking what you looking at. Damn. Alright, let me get off because these people right here. It's crazy as hell.